Okay, this is part two of the lab. So I'm using this uh, wider ruler because I can uh, put this edge along the edge of the paper. So I'll be able to have a, um, a straight line on the paper. So that's a straight line. Now I use protractor. I put it at the center of this. Uh, this is that dot here. Okay, and then I select 90 degrees. So this is the position of the object, which is the pin. So once I have this, I'm gonna connect this, even though the uh, experiment is saying put it at um, 10, I'm gonna put it at five. So this is zero and this is the line that we have. I'm gonna put my object at five centimeters. This is the position of this pin. This is the position of the pin after I put the mirror. Okay, now we are ready. So we need to put our mirror here. I'm gonna put the mirror here. Again, we use our heavy object to uh, lean our mirror against that. So this is what we have. Now from the two sides, I'm gonna look for the image of this pin inside the mirror. So from this side, um, I'm gonna close one of my eyes and try to put this exactly uh, along the uh, object that we have. You see, this should be exactly along the image inside the mirror. I hope I'm um, kind of close to that. Now another one, again I put somewhere here and I try to have it along that. It looks okay. So that is a kind of road. I hope it's okay. Um, okay. So this is from this side. Now I'm gonna do the same thing from this side. I put this to, I put this the way that I'll be able to have it exactly along and the image of this, let's see, where should I put that? Put that in here, here, here. Oh, okay, this is a good place. You can see this is along that. You see that I just pick, this is not a good place. <laughs> yes, okay, let's see if I move this a little bit. Okay, I can see that, that it is along the image from this side. No, actually I should put this somewhere here. You see that it takes time and is, is you just need to put this along the image of the object inside the mirror. So I see this point and I need another one. So I'm gonna put this also along that. So I can see this one, this one, and the other object inside the mirror. Okay, that's the best guess that I can have. Now I have all of these pins. Uh, these are along the image on the right side. These two are along the image on the left side. Now we remove the mirror. I'm gonna put dots here next to this, and next to this, and here, here. I can remove them so I can draw the line that I need. So I connect these two lines, these two dots. I connect them, yes. And then I connect them from this side also, these two. Okay. I connect these two. Just a little bit like this. Okay. So we're done. Now, okay, where is the image? Uh, the image of this object. We are going to continue this line on the other side of the mirror, and we are going to use um, like uh, dash lines, and the same thing here. I'm going to use this, and I'm going to do dash line again, okay? So this is, if this is the object and this is distance between the object and the mirror, this is the position of the image. So this distance from here to here is the I, mean distance from the image to the mirror. It seems it's much smaller than that five. 
So again, I got 3.5 centimeters, but actually this should be the same as this, five centimeters. You try to do your best, but that's what I got, so I just stay with this number. Mm, so DI and DO actually should be the same. It should be closer than that, maybe at least 4.5. Mm, so when you look at the mirror. Okay, now what are these lines? Um, now, if you connect from uh, the object to the mirror, which was there, this is the incident ray from the object to the mirror, and the same thing here. This is the incident ray from object to the mirror, and this is reflected ray from the mirror, and this is the reflected ray from the mirror. Okay, these are reflections. These two blue ones are reflections. The two green ones are incidence rays to mirror. And this, this distance, this distance should be the same for a flat mirror. Again, I have error. I hope you can do it better uh, and you can get a better result. Thank you. Okay.